Manchester United in a UEFA Champions League semi-final. It has a special ring to it, Lee. Well, it does, and the talking stops here. Certainly in the semi-finals I've ever played. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. And the idea tonight is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And Skull for the cross. Corner award defender, you can't afford to take your eyes off Romelu Lukaku. What sort of game do you think we'll see from Lukaku, Lee Dixon? Well, he's big, he's strong, he's powerful. He needs to impose himself on the game. Scare the defender in front of him, then you will get your delights in front of goal. Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. He's to head that one over the bar. This time he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. Matip. Now, Origi. Liverpool obsessed with finding a forward gear. Now, what can they do from this position? That will give them quite the lift. An early opening goal lead. Well, you always want to start quickly, and there's a, certainly a quick start there. What a finish. Well, I just love to look at perfect technique, and you won't get any better than this. It's just a dream strike. Brilliant, brilliant effort. Underway once more, Liverpool have the lead. Scott McTominay. Lindelof now, Fred with it. It's with Pereira now, Gilditch. He's been a bit unlucky. Henderson has it. He has plenty of support. Will there be a tangible end product? Over the touchline for a throw in. Shakiri. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? And using Origi. Well, body in the way. Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, here we see a better angle on it. There's nothing the keeper can do. A significant deflection, and he's beaten. A bit more analysis as regards the goal. It's going their way. 2-0. Henderson has it. Here's Milner. Liverpool continue to advance. Will they be able... Let's see what he has in store for them. And dribbling with it. But Any sort of lead is important. They have the lead. What have you made of it so far? Well, it's all going well for Liverpool. Just... It's tight, control of the ball is key when a game's like this. They have the players to do it though, but they'll be the happier of the two teams at half time. And he might be through here. Mane! And the header so near. Well, he's in a great position. Technique. That's just a natural reader of the game, Fred. Romelu Lukaku. And this would reduce the deficit. And it's gone in. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. as they kick off again 2-1 the Goal current state of affairs your Mane now the first half story has been written here at Old Trafford tonight and running in the second half Liverpool currently on top Rigi speculative effort here what a corner kick it is let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage corner kick played over well thumped clear 
Virgil van Dijk. He has time to play it over. And Fabinho. But it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Whatever way you slice it, a good night's work for this fellow so far. Lee? Well, it's nearly all going right. Hit the woodwork, his team's winning, he's scored a goal. What more can he do in this second half? We'll have to wait and see. And the defender finding a solution to the problem. Marcus Rashford. Well, regaining possession for his side, cleverly. Pereira, Lukaku waiting, well clattered away, it's with Pereira now, well it's a poor tackle, and now it's with Marcus Rashford, he put it in quite to enough, and a no-nonsense clearance. Manchester United getting higher and higher up the pitch, what can they produce from this position? Is it going to be? Well, can he make this move count? Can he open them up here? Can they slot at home? And options in the centre. Will there be a tangible end product? He was certainly in. The chance was there. But credit has to go to the defender league. Well, part of the defender's job is to put players off doing their job. And that's exactly what they do there. It's a decent effort in the end, but under pressure. And using Origi. Now, what can he do here? A Mane in the thick of things. And you need your defender to take charge. McTominay. Very much run of the mill as saves go. An abundance of space. And he has been ruled offside here. Can't have been by an awful lot. Oh, I'm not so sure, but the linesman's got a better view than I have. Number 33, Andrew Robertson. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Passed into the penalty area. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Wijnaldum now. And Milner. And going through Mane. Well, the diving save it was. I think that might have been for the cameras, Lee. Well, he could have thrown his cap on that. Liverpool corner given. Over it comes. And he's clear his lines. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? Alexander Arnold has it. Thumped clear. Wijnaldum, James Milner. Here is Fred. Attempting to play catch-up in this second half. Lee, what ought the priorities to be? United in the past have been late goal specialists. They won't give up, we know that. Pile on the pressure. Surely they will get one more chance. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. The, the electronic... Pushes. Crossing possibilities. The goalkeeper was called upon, and they still have an opportunity here. And with that, the referee blows his whistle. It's... up to the game and it's still lashing down here at Anfield I'm Derek Ray and joining me here on the commentary box for complete coverage is Lee. Plenty of work to do after the first leg, not quite good enough really, they'll need a better performance tonight if they're to progress to the next round and Mane Henderson has it will there be a tangible end product and it's Fred, well, regaining possession for his son. Just a thorough reader of the game, and there we saw it. 
Will he play it in? Well, let's see. Does he mean business? Marcus Rashford. Is he going to punish them here? Lukaku! And a goal just when they needed it. It puts them level on aggregate, but they trail on away goals. Well, we're going to see the replay here. You can't head the ball in the net if you don't get any crosses in. The crosses are coming in thick and fast, and that was a beauty. That made the goal. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Overall, in this tie, it is 2 2. Goal for Manchester United. Henderson has it. Romelu Lukaku. Virgil van Dijk. Milner. It is a decent looking attack here. And he's clear his lines. Romelu Lukaku now. Here's Luke Shaw. Carrying a genuine threat here. Lukaku in position. Well thumped clear. McTominay and the cross is very much on fine cross into the middle and it's gone behind for the corner and they've gone for the short corner oh a truly magnificent piece of goalkeeping there well it is his job Derek Cole obsessed with finding a forward gear now what can they do from this position and no nonsense defensive clearance. And it's Fred. Romelu Lukaku. Clattered away. It's with Pereira now. Fred with it. Shaw. And it's Fred. And options in the centre. He's in with a chance. And a timely goal to give them security and breathing room. What a chance they have now of making it through. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, a bit more analysis as regards the goal. Well, plenty of goals if you look at the aggregate. 3-2 here. United. Number 18, Ashley Young. Matip now. Fred with it. Lindelof now. No more time left. First half. And they're underway in the second half of this Champions League semi-final second leg. Henderson. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Marcus Rashford. Corner given to United. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. To be replaced by... Number 33, Daniel Sturridge. Now the execution of the corner. Rashford! Well, he was being very closely marked, but the header not on the target. Now Paul continue to advance. Will they be able to convert? Well, the man for the dramatic diving stops, Davy De Gea. Well, they practice agility in training. There's no one more agile than De Gea. Coming onto the pitch, number five, Jorginho Gudani. Over it comes. Well, the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. And it's gone through Sturridge. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. Well, visionary passing. Marcus Rashford in position. And the danger cleared. And scope for the cross. And it's Fred. Straightforward piece of good. Wijnaldum. And now Jordan Henderson. Fabinho now. 
Sadio Mane now. And passing with a velvet touch. Staunch rearguard action. Thunders clear. Uh, what will be the thinking in the camp, Lee Dixon? Well, all the United players will be looking up at the clock. Time is ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue those missed chances? They could be costly. Will there be a tangible end product? And it might be. And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Now, what can he do here? And now the whistle United fans wanted to hear. Manchester United have ascended to the high altar of the Champions League final.